Then, if you slide back after the clear signs have come to you, then know that Allah is almighty, all wise. Do they then wait for anything other than that Allah should come to them in the shadows of the clouds and the angels? Then the case would already be judged, and to Allah return all matters for decision. Ask the children of Israel how many clear proofs we gave them, and whoever changes Allah's favor after it had come to him, then surely Allah is severe in punishment. Beautified is the life of this world, for those who disbelieve, and they mock of those who believe. But those who obey Allah's orders, and keep away from what He has forbidden, will be above them on the Day of Resurrection. And Allah gives of His bounty on the Day of Resurrection, to whom He wills without limit. Mankind was one nation, and Allah sent prophets with glad tidings and warnings. And with them, He sent the scripture in truth, to judge between a people in matters in which they differed. And only those to whom the scripture was given differed concerning it after clear proofs had come to them through hatred one to another. Then Allah by his leave guided those who believed to the truth of that in which they differed. And Allah guides whom he wills to a straight path. Or do you think that you will enter paradise without such trials as came to those who passed away before you? They were afflicted with severe poverty and ailments, and were so shaken that even the messenger and those who believed along with him said, When will the help of Allah come? Yes, certainly the help of Allah is near. They ask you, O Muhammad, what they should spend. Say, Whatever you spend of good must be for your parents and kindred, and the orphans and the poor and the wayfarers, and whatever you do of good deeds, truly, Allah knows them well. Fighting in Allah's cause is ordained for you Muslims even though you dislike it. And it may be that you dislike a thing which is good for you and that you like a thing which is bad for you. Allah knows but you do not know. They ask you concerning fighting in the sacred months, say, Fighting then is a great transgression. But a greater transgression with Allah is to prevent mankind from following the way of Allah to disbelieve in him, to prevent access to the sacred mosque in Mecca, and to drive out its inhabitants. And suffering is worse than killing. They will never cease fighting you until they turn you back from your religion if they can. And whoever of you turns back from his religion and dies as a disbeliever, then his deeds will be lost in this life and in the hereafter. And they will be the dwellers of the fire. They will abide there forever. Indeed, those who have believed and those who have emigrated for Allah's religion and have striven hard in the way of Allah, they all hope for Allah's mercy and Allah is oft forgiving, most merciful. They ask you, O Muhammad, concerning alcoholic drink and gambling, say, in them is a great sin and some benefit for men, but the sin is greater than their benefits. And they ask you what they ought to spend, say, that which is beyond your needs. Thus Allah makes clear to you his laws in order that you may give thought. On this worldly life and in the hereafter they ask you concerning orphans, say, the best thing is to work honestly in their property and if you mix your affairs with theirs then they are your brothers. And Allah knows him who means mischief from him who means good. And if Allah had wished he could have put you into difficulties Truly, Allah is almighty, all-wise.